three, two, one, go! Play. Welcome back to an all new episode concert. <laughs> Today I'm here with my son Hamza. Say hi. Hi. And together we'll be unboxing the all new Hexbug Arena Max. That is right. They're back at it again with an all new BattleBots Arena. This here is the latest one featuring double the size, more destroying mechanisms, as well as a full customization so you can go ahead and create your own BattleBots and battle it out. Now, together we'll be unboxing it, playing together, and seeing who's going to win. Are you going to win? Yeah! <laughs> uh, so, big special thanks to the good folks over at Hexbug for sending us over. And if you guys wanted your own, be sure to check out their link down below in the description. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> So this here is our packaging. This here's our box. Uh, really big box. It kind of has like a peekaboo display. Looks like we have like an orange one and a blue one. You can see like this almost like a ripper thing going over here and uh, it actually looks really cool. So they definitely upped it up compared to the original. Uh, so I'm excited to see exactly how this plays out. Now as we kind of rotate it about, shows you a little bit more in terms of the details about what's going on. For instance, uh, you have uh, push activated pulverizers. Uh, you have turn on the screw and watch the spinning blades devour your challenger. Uh, it says weaken your rival's defenses by ramming them against the, the spiked walls. So, you know, there's a lot of things going on. Uh, and then these include these plates. So not like just the paper or cardboard that they had in the original. These actually have plastic plates kind of building it together. Now you can go ahead and customize the weaponry, so you can go ahead and pick and choose and just make your own battle bot. Let's open it up and see what's inside. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! It's so cool! So one thing I love about Hexbug is their intricate design concept. So they don't just throw it in the box, they create this nice looking display. But again, it is quite difficult to unbox. <laughs> Uh, so let's just go ahead and fast forward and see what we have. All right, so this here is everything uh, opened up and there's actually a lot of pieces to it. Now we have these plates and these are actually like good quality plates. These are plastic, so not your traditional cardboard stuff that you had before. And then you have these really like sturdy frames. Uh, one of the issues with the previous ones is they would bend easily. So I don't see these actually bending at all. And then like, check this thing out. This thing is absolutely insane. Uh, and then we get these pulverizers. Look at this. So you can go ahead and destroy the opponent. So we also have our battle bots. So these here are our battle bots. We have tombstone uh, and then we have barna kills, barna kills. Uh, and then we have these different accessories. So we have, looks like a spinning top here. Uh, when we have these different like bulldozers and like, like these pincers and just a variety of different components that you can go ahead and essentially customize to create your own battle bot. With that said, let's go ahead and set this thing up next and see what it looks like built. Wow, this thing is gigantic. It's not even fitting our table. <laughs> all right, so we're also ready to go. Time to go ahead and make our uh, battle bots. Uh, so which one are you gonna be, Hamza? Uh, you want to be Tombstone or do you want to be the uh, Barnacle? Uh, this one. You want to be Tombstone? Okay, and then I'll be Barnacles. All right, so this is how it's going to look. So this is just a simple, uh, you got that, like that fan kind of action right there. Is this? <laughs> uh, yeah, it could be either one. So let's see if this works. So we're going to turn it on by pressing this blue button here. There we go. And you press the top button and it'll turn it on. Look at that. <laughs> Sweet. Uh, and then I'll put this thing on. I want to try this guy. This thing looks crazy. I'm gonna get you. You're gonna get me? I'm gonna get you. No, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> I'll put this one on. Man, this thing looks cool. That's that. So this is our mine. I could turn this on. <laughs> wait, 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 not yet, not yet. So we're gonna go ahead and start off here and we're gonna start yours here. And remember, you could do these too. Okay. Okay, and I'm gonna turn this on. 
Okay. Wow! All right, you ready, Hamza? Yeah. Three, two, one. Go! Bye. All right. Oh. This one's not really moving that well, though. Oh! Come on! Whoa! Whoa! Oh no, my wheel's coming off! This thing is not working good. Oh! Look at you! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's done, he's done, he's done. Oh, he must. Oh. Is it broke too? How'd you break that? Uh, I ended up having to swap out my particular battle bot just because it didn't work. I'm not sure exactly why, uh, but it was not functioning correctly and the, the controls were not kind of corresponding with it. Uh, so we're going to try a different one here. And you ready, Hamza? Yes. Yeah. All right, let's do this. We're going to turn this on here and let's fight. Come over here. Ah! <laughs> oh! No! Okay, stuck on the corner. Let's go by this thing. Come on. Oh no! Thank <laughs> <laughs> you! Oh no! Ah! <laughs> How are you? A lot of fun. I really like all the new destruction that they have. Definitely double the size is a lot more fun. Now there's a few mishaps. For instance, both of the pulverizers broke. And that's because inside here there's a plastic mechanism and it just kind of snaps when you apply a lot of force. Obviously when you're battling it out, you're in the moment. So these will break quite easily. So just exercise caution, especially with little kids uh, or an adult <laughs> that got overly excited. Uh, you want to make sure you just be careful with that. I wish they would actually Actually created like a spring mechanism or a metal bracket that would be nice maybe in the future we'll see that uh, this particular part here with the blades really cool definitely creates a unique aspect in fighting uh, but other than that really fun definitely gonna be using this going forward there's a lot of sharp edges so do exercise caution with younger kids and yeah overall a lot of fun now thank you again for watching uh, if you guys have any questions feel free to comment down below otherwise we'll see you guys next time take care now bye bye, bye, -bye.